welcome back today i am going to present how to export dxf or gbr file from hfss if the circuit contains via and ground plane slots so basis on basis on request i am going to present this video so in this video we intentionally in contribute some a vias and ground plane slot so this is a demo design in this design you can see this is a copper plate top copper plate and one vi is placed here that is touch the ground plane and in ground plane you can see one slot i have taken so the intention is how to export all layers successfully so do this job first let us consider first how i have to export top portion so to export top portion first make sure your design is in xy plane so it is a clever design so in this case i have chosen the design is in xy plane and z is the upper portion another important thing you can follow also when you are start to design so the thing is that this metal plate is just above the xy and this substrate is just below the xy plane so it is very intellectual part you can do this thing also so when i delete all the part except the top plane it will lie at z equals to 0 and x y plane once i delete the top portion and keep the bottom portion means substrate portion it will keep just touch the x y plane so i can easily take the top and bottom portion okay let's go for uh, export top portion so to do that to do this first i have to delete all the unnecessary part so top portion will be remain there so top portion strip i have written here so this is on ground portion this is ground plane uh, this is vacuum box so first i have to delete this vacuum box then i have to delete this substrate then i have to delete via then ground plane so and another part is this web port so i have deleted all the parts then make sure this plane is arrive at x equals to x y plane and z equals to 0 yes it is z equals to 0 so now it is ready to export as a top plane so first let's go to hfss sorry modular export make a file names okay the export is completed you can see in this window now i have to undo it to recover its previous portion okay now i have to export board outline after that i can export bottom plane so first i have to do next board outline so to do that first i have to delete all portion except substrate portion just i delete it then only substrate portion is there and see this portion is lie at z equals to zero now board outline is ready so next modeler export board outline board outline is complete 
export now i have to go undo it then now next portion is bottom portion so to select the bottom portion i have to delete all parts except ground plane part so this ground portion part is remaining see there is a small change i have to do so this ground plane is not in z equals to 0 so i have to make it is z equals to 0 so select ground then start from minus stitches written here so make it 0 all parts remaining same so it is coming at another portion we have to make z equals to 0 now it is in z equals to 0 column and ready to export now top bottom board outline is completed next part is okay next part is how to export only that cylinder part via part so remaining via you have to delete against all the files so via is remaining and make sure this vi is placed in z equals to zero plan how can you confirm it make view design properties orientation top So see it is in it is in z equals to zero plane so make it clear so now it is go export it export via via dxf i have completed so all the parts separately one by one i have completed now dxf is ready for another software you can use deep trace software so deep trace software one trial basis you can obtain from the deep trace website so in this software first go to file import dxf then first i am giving top file so top file is coming make it millimeter convert to top fill close radius sometimes due to resolution problem some time it is not coming here so make the resolution properly to obtain this option so now make it import top is coming you can see top portion here another part now export sorry import dxf board outline so make it add convert to board outline fill closed area import fill close board outline is coming next import dxf bottom dx so bottom is coming so make it make sure it is add convert block bottom and you see one thing here so if i make this fill closed area then it will close all the portion so there is no meaning of slot so you have to each out this metal portion so click on embedded polygon so what is the polygon is there it will be embedded so one by one all portion is covered here so bottom portion you can see this portion is this down portion is bottom it is mention is here also and this black 
black portion is nothing is there means copper plate will be each out and top portion which is the pearl portion this top is retained now next part is export of via sorry import of via it is very crucial part so go to import dxf via so all the portion you will convert block make it pad holes then import it Sorry, uh, actually this pad is already existing, so the, that option is right option. So you can use this pad option means file, import, and then dxf and select pad. So it is already coming. Actually, repeatedly I have did it three times. No need of this one. Then this pad is there. So now you have to do one thing. So you have to select this via. And you have to place static via here. So this is go to placement, place static via. Then via properties. So make it uh, one the unit. I have to change better. millimeter now here properties i have chosen here is 0.5 mm inner and outer same will be same sorry diameter is 1 mm we apply to current here so this via portion is completed Now place it here. Means whatever via is earlier position, so you have to connect it here like this. Then you delete your earlier portion, earlier via. Now it's completed. Now go to here file export GBR top. Another thing is that make it offset zero, then export top GBR, then bottom GBR. Then board outline export N by C drill that is through hole plating. This drill will be there. So make sure it is again zero, diameter is one, then export it. So through dot DRL. This is this information is only for 
via part so it is completed now you can check it just take it save as no then place one by one import gbr top top portion is coming then another portion bottom portion bottom gbr add bottom then import gbr board outline gbl next import then i see drill through dot drl yeah it is plated so see this portion is perfect so now it is completed now you can use this file to any particular automated machine cnc or that type of machine so it will get automatically you can get your structure so one problem is, is that we are placing some little bit option is there also so you can place via in directly but i have i did it manually so first i take the trace of the via and in place of that via i place static via that is from the placement sorry that from object place a static via just in place of that via so hope you enjoyed this video and please like and share it to spread this information to your friends also thank you